Hi and welcome to Dr. Mix. On this video I will explain how to bounce multiple tracks in Cubase. This is for when you need to transfer your session to another system or to a professional mixing and mastering service like Dr. Mix. So here's how you do it. First, set your left and right locators to your project length. Remember to leave a bit of time at the end of the song for the reverbs and delays to tail off. Go to File and select Export, Audio Mix Down. Under the Channel Selection field, tick Channel Batch Export. Then check the boxes of all the tracks you wish to export. It's good to go and select Output Channels, Stereo Out as well, to have a reference mix. Cubase lets you export audio and instruments channels, as well as buses. You don't need to export buses, but you can leave the effects channels on if you wish to retain a specific reverb or delay effect. Now add the name of your track in the Name field. Then click on the little arrow in the Path field underneath. Click Choose and create a new folder where Cubase will save the exported files. Adding the BPM on the folder's name is a great idea. Click on the Naming Scheme button and make sure that the channel name and counter fields are specified. If they are not, you can add them back by clicking on the plus button. Just like that. Under File Format, select WAVE as it's compatible with both Mac and PCs. You can leave all of the other boxes unchecked. Sample rate and bit depth should always be the same as the original recording. 44.1 and 24 are considered the standard. All other boxes can be left unchecked. Leave Pull, Audio Track and Create New Project unchecked. Finally, set Post Process to None and leave Deactivate External MIDI Inputs checked. Now hit Export and off you go.